My name's Christian Brock. I'm one of the co-module leads for the Advanced Clinical Trials module in the Master's Programme in Clinical Oncology. The University of Birmingham is blessed with two fantastic clinical trials units. CRCTU, that's my employer, is one of the largest cancer trials units in Europe and it conducts trials from uh, dose finding studies in phase one all the way through to pivotal phase three studies. So we have a lot of expertise at every single one of the trial phases and this course is going to use all of our experience to convey why trials are conducted the way they are in modern therapies and cancer. So the advanced clinical trials module is aimed at students that want to go beyond the basics of clinical trials, that want to understand why modern trials are designed and analysed the way they are. The advanced clinical trials module will be led by four professional trialists here at CRCTU with clinical and academic expertise and will focus on why trials are designed the way they are these days. So to give some example, immunotherapy drugs in 2016 constituted the most trialled drugs. Now those drugs have only been invented relatively recently but already they've changed the way that we think about dose finding, the way we think about adverse events, about clinical outcomes, about the heterogeneity of, of patients. So, the landscape of clinical trials is really changing and we're expertly placed to convey how that's happening and why. Okay, so we expect the advanced clinical trials module to be important for anyone who consumes clinical research, particularly clinical trials, be that at an academic institution or perhaps a pharma company. Um, it's really going to go beyond just the basics so that people can understand why trials are conducted the way they are nowadays. Lectures for this module will take place on five consecutive days. Uh, there will be some statistics, but only enough to enable the students to understand why trials are designed and analysed the way they are. Uh, we will start with some revision, revision sessions on statistics and, and the basics of clinical trials, but after we've covered that, we're going to move on in depth into uh, dose finding studies, some modern approaches to phase two studies, advanced methods at pivotal phase three studies, and then also uh, pivotal studies in rare diseases, which is one of our strengths at the University of Birmingham. The advanced clinical trials module is about new treatments, new methodologies, new combinations, new trial designs. This is not a crash course in statistics that could be read out of like an old textbook. This is about research that's taking place the world over in trials units right now. And I think that's a pretty exciting thing to learn about.